God. This is the <laughs> lining of a cow's stomach. Oh! Look at the jiggle. <laughs> nah, that's hectic shit. Hello, everybody. And welcome back. Keep going. <laughs> You're looking dashing today. Yeah, I'm kind of uh, a mix between a good-looking school shooter and, like, a, you know, a punk. Well, I see you've got the University of Markle shirt on, so it's yeah. like you're... He's a professor. You've mixed that into... He, a, he does look like a, a, a university professor in 2024. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> Brown had his own show on the website where you do I, lectures. I think you're... And no one watched it. Yeah, no one's going to watch it. I no, think but you still did it, though. I think you're overestimating my talents and... Concrete yeah. lectures. Yeah. <laughs> that would be so shit. Well, the offer's there if you want. We'll pay you five grand a week. I'm done. <laughs> oh, man. I shook on it. That's I a would. promise. Five I grand promise you, a week. I promise you we'll do that. It's a oh. lie. <laughs> we swear. He did it. He, 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 he promised. Has to now. No, that's a lie. We oh. Can't. Guys, um, episode thirty-four. Thirty-four. We've got. We're a little bit. Uh, we're a little bit flat because um, we had a pretty wild weekend. I'm actually alive and well because I was not there. Yeah, but you guys you, had a wild. You weekend. pulled out. I did pull out. You never pull out. You always finish up it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh man! And, um, Pregnant. Before we get into the weekend. Um, Let's remind you guys the live show is quickly approaching. Okay, by the time this comes out, it's like it's less than a month away. Oh right? my god! Ticket sales are creeping along, but look, we've got. Um, is it a month from now or a month from when this comes out? It'll be a month when this comes out. Less oh. than a month when this comes out. It's already nearly a month. Like there's not much time left, right? So guys, get your tickets. All right, the link is in the description. It's a live show with us. And the Reese Bros are going to be there, and then we're going to an after party after, and we're going to spend the whole night with you guys. And it's just going to, it's a fun, wild night. All right. Last so time we were out till like 5 a.m. Yeah. It's at the Princess Theatre in Brisbane on a Friday night. All right. And it's just a good time. All the Marty Michael crew's coming. I think Paulie said he's going to come. Paulie uh, came last uh, year. What a legend. Yeah. Um, who else is coming? Um, Jackson and Lockie might. They're not confirmed or denied yet. But look, it's just it's just a fun time. Yeah, right? if you're not from Brisbane, it's an excuse to come up here for the weekend. Mm. Yeah, and it's a great venue. We went and saw it last week and there's like there's two bars at the back of the theatre. So you can just get up while you're watching us, go to the bar, grab a beer and then come sit back down. Yeah, I think last time they had to sort of stock up uh, yeah. had like four or five. Yeah, the yeah. last few venues you had to leave leave the whole theatre, the, the room and walk and, and grab a beer and yeah. then come back. And you could only really do it during intermission. So this time you can drink throughout, which is probably not good for us. Yeah. This place yeah. caters for yeah entertaining. And it is a nice venue. It's, so it's the nicest pretty. venue we've ever had. So old school. It's like, you know, the 1700s sort of shit. Yeah, so so if you're thinking about it, look, just come along, $50 a ticket, and uh, see what it's all about, man. Yeah, get into it. It's going to be fun. There's going to be some firsts oh, for yeah, us. Yeah, there is a first coming. There is oh, a first. I'm sure it's confirmed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This, yeah it's, it's going to be... Hopefully like, it comes in the mail. It's not going to be like... It's not going to clear out the whole venue like yeah. last year's stunt yeah. did. <laughs> but look, it's pretty... Like it's something that you want to see. It's going to be worth die. watching. Yeah, it's not cool, but it's not not uncool. It's shocking. <laughs> it's just really, really shocking to see. It's not. It doesn't smell or anything, and you won't. There's nothing going to be like you. You won't. You won't have to. It, it's just a visual stunt that you won't be able to look away from. Yeah, it's and beautiful. it's a first. There's it's a dead beautiful. person there. Well, yeah. look, it's partly. It is, it is a dead part. Well, it's quite dead. Kind of. Stop telling people. Kind of. Look, that, we'll leave it at that, all right? But but corpse. That's all we're going to say. Corpse. Body. We'll part. leave it at that. Oh. Anyway, the weekend gone. My God. We just we went to uh, Tom and Jess's wedding. They invited us. We, you guys heard us call them on the phone a few weeks ago. And we invited them to their wedding and we went along. And it was an absolutely lovely little wedding, Matt. You f***ing missed out bad. Sorry. You f***ing loved it, man. 
Sorry we, about we did a performance. Yeah, yeah we, I caught a glimpse of that. And a speech. And um, look, it was just, it was bloody great all around. Did it you was, guys vlog the whole thing? Yeah, so Marty, last minute, we, we figured out that they'd met on Tinder. Yeah, they said during the ceremony, they're like, oh, you know, we, we met on Tinder. So they during the speech. Right to each other. So then Marty quickly goes, all right, let's tie a Tinder segment into this. Oh, my so God. So he, he went back and looked at their transcript of their Tinder convo. And I read that out during it. the speech. Yeah, and he read Did it you out. make some adjustments? Maybe. <laughs> it, yeah, look, it was it was pretty good. It was quite beautiful. We started a pretty horrific rumor. Oh, too. yeah, yeah, we did. That'll all be in the website video. But, yeah, we... And it's, it could go wrong. The rumor could have gone wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The rumor, like, if there's a chance... There were some people have... that didn't like us there, I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, I feel like there would be some hate. Yeah, because, yeah, anyway. But what? as long as Tom and Jess were happy, we're happy. I yeah. saw a glimpse of what was happening and then... I tried to look at the people's reactions and there was a lot of people filming and people laughing. And then I saw one dude, he just had his arms crossed. Oh, really? And I was like, yeah. No, oh, there were definitely some definitely upset the, people the there. Yeah. hated person. There. Yeah, well, with the things we, because people don't like, a lot of people who don't know us, like imagine going to your mates or family members' wedding and these two random <laughs> wankers show up doing all this weird shit. Like, I'd yeah. probably be like, who the f are these guys as well? It'd be pretty random. Yeah. We gave a, a gift to them too. Yeah. And um, now we're Indeed. feeling it. It was a pretty big night, even though we left at like 11 or whatever it was. It was a uh, pretty big night, man. I haven't drank for a while. And God, yeah, so the anxiety just carries on for days now. Yeah, you feel like shit for ages. Oh, yes, oh. I was just bedridden. You you cop it worse than anyone, though. I've ever, out of all of our friends, I've never seen anyone struggle more. Yeah, well, it's, it's, true. it's not even the next day. It's like the, it's the, the day week. after. The next week is, is affected. Yeah, hangovers get longer and longer now. Yeah, I just want to lie in a dark room and just not be spoken to just watch my videos on repeat <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah um you guys filmed a video that was oh it was oh, yeah it has marks god yeah we've been filming website content because we're trying to bank it up because um you know end of year is quickly approaching <laughs> and we want to have a break so there was time we've been stressing about this video for a long time it's mm. called the worst worst and it's not even it's probably a part one of a series we can do because there are so many worsts that we have. As you guys know, we do like what, you know, what what kitchen object hurts the most, what f garden object hurts the most, what power tool hurts the most. We've done these videos throughout our career. And, and so just on the week on, we did what's the worst worst. So we got all the worsts, well, eight of the worsts oh, what you've that we've done had so far. And put them all and we want to see what the worst worst was. And that was a f and rough videos usually like we build up to the real painful shit at the end but it was just non-stop pain oh man yeah my body is fucked like, that was, we're covered in bruises I came, did cuts. i come i came towards the end or halfway through it i can't remember and that's the most that's the most gore i've oh, seen oh man the, the most the blood, blood all over my ass oh. Dude, it was rough i've what? never seen so much blood come out of a hole yeah but, so we shot a power we got a potato cannon and the tennis ball, but the, as we know, that's a 10 out of 10 pain usually if it's done correctly. But we thought, oh, let's step it step up. Step it up. And f Michael super glued all these thumbtacks to but it. But you, you double stepped it up. They weren't normal thumbtacks. They Your were like nails. double, double Man, ones. There was one that stayed in my oh, and, and then, as soon as I pulled it out, it just started piercing. Well, because it hit my tailbone. So it kind of hammered the thumbtack into my tailbone. And the bone came out. Oh, Imagine man. Imagine if it fractured your tailbone. Yeah. No. Well, yeah. Oh. That's my spine. My tailbone's spine. Dude. Yeah. But it was very bloody. And then I thought, I thought you were like, I have to admit, I thought you kind of like took it easy with the, what yeah, you no. got done with. And when I, when I, but then I saw your marks and I was like, oh my God. Yeah, I've turned myself. I'm trying to bring back thing. Yeah, don't do that. Yeah, sorry. But um, yeah, uh, very impressive what yeah, you guys well, did, but very, very bloody. Yeah, so that'll be coming on the oh, website man. too. And halfway, you weren't there, but halfway through, at so At the very funny. beginning. Yeah, no, yeah. At the very beginning, as we start filming, just before we do the first stunt, this like little like- Stranger. This stranger <laughs> just walks into our backyard yeah. And was like, is this so and so park? Looking and for a park. And we're like, yeah, yeah, this is the park. Because we thought it'd be funny on camera. 
And then, well, and then she's like, oh, what are you doing? And they're like, oh, we're the park entertainers. Like we just offer an entertainment for anyone that comes across this park. And so she stayed and watched, watched the first couple of stunts and was just f***ing horrified. Yeah, she was so, so shocked at what was going on. It was such a, that was like the, one of the randomest, most weirdest like coincidences ever. But like, how could you not know as a park? There's a f***ing house here yeah, and cars yeah, everywhere. And a yeah. destroyed car. By oh, the way, man. it didn't look friendly and inviting. Yeah, I know. And then to come around the house. Yeah. yeah. And she just sort of sat there Perfect. and watched for a while. Perfect timing. Yeah. yeah. We've had a few funny, like, little fellows that come into, like, the. Into videos. videos. Remember the one at the. Uh, at an actual park and the, <laughs> and you just came up and you. And you yeah, that was. Well, in you public, guys. it's understandable, but when it's at your own bloody house, it's a bit weird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the reason you have it, oh, so you man. have privacy. Yeah, but. Ryan, I've never seen him, like, genuinely just laughing at such strange, like, <laughs> circumstances. He's just pissing himself behind the camera. Couldn't believe that she was there. Oh. So yeah, that was our weekend and week. It's been uh, good, and then this week we're going camping in two two nights. Man, yeah, that's gonna be wow. Well, look, if you guys like pistillery, we're doing a part two of that. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be. We gotta. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty weird. The Kraken Mc boys are coming camping too, so. It's always a good time. There's always just silly, f- like funny shit happens. We get we get to do Lord of the Rings quotes together. They love doing Lord of the Rings quotes. Yeah, that's last fun. time they came camping with us, that's when we filmed like I don't know the, a jewel off, basically me versus. Oh Mike. yeah, you know, what was and that called again? What the jewel called? off. Yeah, it was like something jewels. And and like, the opening for that was just so good. Yeah, poor Connor. <laughs> <laughs> he had to cop, cop a, a yeah a, a horrific abuse. Um, at the beginning of it, we won't say the word, but it was. Didn't yeah. didn't the cracker milk van get stuck on like a concrete? Oh, that was wall? the first camp trip. This is camp oh, trip sorry. number three. Yeah, wow. Oh, really? a couple three times. Three or four. Yeah, three really? or four. But yeah, so they're coming along. It's going to be a good time. And then we get a week off. I don't. But yeah, you, Matt has to go to work. Yeah, still has to work. He's forty hours, but we get a week off. Yeah, I'm going to play golf. Matt Brown went to boxing this morning. He's improving. He started, we did a little like a, a jab off. He was starting to sort of block uh, jabs, pop a few I'm, to the face. I don't know if I'm improving, but I'm having a good time. Yeah, he's getting there. He's yeah. getting fit yeah. up. I've noticed uh, the coaches are becoming a lot more meaner um, oh, yeah, as dude. I go. That was so welcoming at, at the first one. Yeah. And well, then look, now they throw loves, a little, love. threw little mean mean things at me. Yeah. Dude, Although right. I went I went to the, the class on my own the other day and the guy, I can't f- Jerry. Yeah, I can't remember his name. Shit. And um and yeah, he was <laughs> he was so mean to me. We we're doing um there there was a punishment if you f- up the footwork. It was like three push ups and everyone was pretty like knew what they were doing and I did not know what I was doing. So and he just kept giggling every time I'd f- I was air con <laughs> every time. And he was just like this. He was, every time I and he <laughs> just pointed at me and made me do three. And I, I think I did like 20 push ups. Yeah, look, and you got to tuck those elbows in. They're always poking out. Yeah. Get those elbows in more. But yeah. you'll get there. I'm very impressed. It's, it's, it's the best fitness I think I've ever done. Yeah, it's, dude. I feel so good at the end. It's a burn. It's a burn. And it will only get easier the more you do it. And next minute, you'll be knocking. Someone out, hopefully. So when, we don't know yet, guys. You can yeah, knock, we'll and see. once you have that skill, you can go around and knock anyone out. Yeah. You have an argument with someone, yeah. knock them out. You'll help them at work. I can go out. down to um, someone cuts you off in traffic. Go and knock them yeah. out. I can go to SunCorp and, and just start fight, knocking fight people, people out. Yeah. You can do it, yeah, anywhere. Mm. But look, it's not confirmed, but we need you guys to just support us. Let's see if we can get Brown yeah, on the Hopefully car. by the time this is out. We no, might, by the way, we saw, I think we did a call asking you guys to go and comment on the latest Alpha Blokes events Instagram post. And thank you guys for doing that. Yeah, that was a you. fucking shitload of comments. That's a so bunch of beautiful. Love our little That's powerful, so hot. powerful army. I want to check that. I haven't seen that yet. Yeah. There's some pretty yeah. funny. Someone said, I can't remember who it was. They were like, let Matt Brown do a shit in the ring. Oh, <laughs> it was very might, good. If you get knocked out hard enough and yeah, you much in your bells, you might shit yourself. <laughs> Would you? If we gave you money, would you do a sh in the room? How much? Uh, That's a lot of money. And then I've got to push it out to 3K. Well, you can can do a shit in your pants before you walk out and then afterwards. Oh, that's even worse. Well, yeah, I don't think you'll be the fun. If you were, I don't think you'd be the main event. So, like. Yeah, I'd ruin the event. 
Yeah, maybe that was probably like the that. first first fight of the night, and then I shit the ring, and then ruin for everyone. Yeah, else. we probably can't do that, but man, it would be funny. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm looking forward to the night, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be so much nicer this way. We can just relax. You can take all the stress, Brown. Oh, <laughs> Not yeah. only mentally, but physical. Getting yeah. punched in the oh, face. Man, all the sucks. risk. Is, well, you take all the risk on board. Everything on your shoulders. You see, you get hit. You get oh, hit hard enough. Stop everything lights representing up. our entire brand, and like everything's everyone's watching. You, thousands of people. This huge expectation. It's gonna be crazy that we don't have to deal with any of that. One, oh, it's so nice. One good connection to the nose. Your nose is changed forever. It's oh, a different nose. You no, different stop nose. that. What if you get knocked down in the first 20 seconds? Like all That's this hard work for nothing. And that could happen. And when you get hit, you don't even know that you're knocked out till you're out because everything just goes black. And then you'll Lights have the rest black. of your life to think about that moment and be embarrassed and want to redo it, but you can't. It's done. It's recorded. Oh, all right, guys. This is going to be terrible. We gonna, uh, though there's one oh, more bit of news. Um, uh, there was a death. None of my family members died, but um, an actor died. His name was James Earl Jones. <laughs> he recently passed away. Who the f*** is he? He um, is a great actor of many films, but more importantly, he was the voice of Darth Vader from Star Wars. The first few? All of them. Oh, wow. That's, that's okay. So a good thing happened. No, he was also the voice of Mufasa from Lion King. All right. Now I respect that. That's sad. Yeah. What did he sound like? Oh, f- Try and be Darth Vader. No, I can't be a doctor. What about my father? Everything the light touches is our kingdom. I can't do it. Oh. <laughs> he is such a good, <laughs> such a good voice. Vader? No, yeah, he was being Darth Vader <laughs> in The Lion King. Yeah, but dude, he has uh, the like you know one of those iconic voices, and he's gone. Yeah, oh, well. Well. AI oh well, AI will bring it back. Yeah, maybe he lives forever. Do you see that they want to bring in rules now that you know how because you know how they AI and they put people dead people into films now and they CGI them in? They have to get permission now, or they want to have it as you have to get permission from the. the well, that's fair enough. Otherwise, yeah. we could have a Leonardo DiCaprio movie and he wouldn't even have to do anything to win for it. Exactly. Yeah, I think that's how, the way it's going to go eventually. Wow. Let's just, imagine that. Imagine if we could just make our videos, but we didn't have to be in them. Oh man. Well, it could be done. God, that'd be nice. We just sit back and eat hot chips <laughs> <laughs> and ketchup. Yeah, with a little bit of flavoring on them. Oh yeah, <sighs> thanks for that news, Brown. That was very important to know. Mm, sorry, I saw you whispering that to James earlier. That's oh, so got something shit. so cool to talk I, about. Uh, I thought it was pretty cool. Anyway, we got a jam-packed episode. We got trauma trivia. Rest in peace, Darth Vader. We got a pretty cool prank, a few pretty cool prank calls to do. We got a fussy little boys and this fussy little boys, I've never had it. I didn't even know what it was, but we've like I looked into it once James showed me oh. and like it's it's renowned to, for its disgustingness. But can you get but sick? Can you no, get no, sick? No, you You've got to can look into no, it no, it's not like the snail where there might be a parasite. No, yeah, none of that. This is this is actual edible food from like a butcher. I'd oh. forgotten about the parasite. I've probably got a f-ing parasite. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think you do. <laughs> oh. Yeah, well, you vomited enough that it might have come out. Lots of worms in your gut. Oh, no. Multiplying. <laughs> Feasting on your insides. Oh, and forget about it. Let's forget about it. <clears throat> um, yeah, so with Tinder today, guys, we're going to call up a past Tinder chick. Who uh, she's from Thailand. She lives in Melbourne, and we need to see if we can buy her house. Yeah, Thailand we called still. her once before. Yeah, yeah. we've called yeah. her before, so we're calling her again. Now, look, Tinder conversations um, were look, because of the weekend. We went to the wedding, and then Sunday I was curled up in a ball, um, fighting back panic attacks. So I haven't had time to do Tinder conversations. I've only got beginnings of them, which I could read out again, but I would prefer to develop them for you guys and have some proper conversations for next week. So. But we will make up for it by calling one of the Tinder girls for the Tinder adventures this week, all right? Will we try that thing with Greg today that you were talking about? I would. I don't I reckon we try it with Greg. He'll immediately be like, this is on the podcast. Like, think yeah. we call him the other day randomly. All right, well, like- Lockie. <laughs> what about Lockie? We just call Lockie with nothing. So this this idea is basically you call up people with no like no reason and then you see what conversation develops from it. You don't really ask any questions. You just call up saying, hey, mate. And then you see, because it's quite awkward silence. Mm. So we see what what Lockie will do when he's given nothing to work with. And we see what conversation Lockie will come up with. 
What do you think about that? I reckon he will. Um, he'll know. Hit pick it pretty quick too. Though it's a podcast. Lockie and Greg, we we've called them so much. If we, if we can think of some, maybe um, Emil. No. <laughs> <laughs> can he, we please do he, a meal? He's away at the moment, so I have to do it when he gets back. <laughs> he's still got his phone on him. No. <laughs> Yeah, Matt's always so protective of a meal. It's because they you f- fuck him or something. It's because they fucked before. No, it's, yes, it's, it I, is, mate. I have the same feeling towards it, like like you do with Ryan. Michael doesn't have that with Ryan. Yeah, he does. I have that with our employees and with Lockie. I don't like to like have them even for a moment think that like be weirded out. It makes me cringe. Maybe we could try Matt. Matt who? Matt Brown. Anyway, let's f- move on and f- shave our f- balls with Manscaped. Mm. Uh, you go to manscaped.com, all right? Get get all your hair tripped off because it helps. They have a new chrome dome shaver. Oh, bullshit. For your head. I'm going to order it and I'm going to bring it on the podcast and we're going to test it. Look, okay, manscaped.com. They've got all kinds of male grooming products. And, and you might be thinking, yeah, that's this sounds really great, boys. But look, I don't have any money. Well, okay, here, 20% off. Fully actual 20 and you get 20% off. What more could you ask for? 50% off? Fine. Done. Use our discount code, 50% off. It may not work. It may only yeah, take 20, it may only be but 20. we're going to say it's 50. We're going to promote it as 50 to 90% off and <laughs> you don't want no unless you go and try it. Fully actual 20 for 90% off. Could be 20%. Never, ever seen before. Just head there, use our discount code. They've got all kinds of shit. Like they said, Matt's looks as good as he does because he uses Manscaped products and they've got a new Chrome Dome. Dome shaver. Oh, I, dome shaver. I need to get I the words the other right day. For that. You know what I really love by them? The, the nose hair. Yeah. As you, uh, boys, as you know, as we get older, hair start to come from places that it wasn't previously, okay? And that's fucking disgusting. And you start to go a bit bald and shit. So you don't want to look like a fucking unkept old man piece of shit. Do you get hair on the ear? Oh, yes. Yeah. Massive what is long hairs, that? like this long. I'm not even kidding. Mm. Hairs this long, long hairs on my back now. Can't my grow them on the head. My ass is just f***ed. Long hairs out of my nose. Yeah, the ass was pretty horrifying. Oh, eyebrow yeah. hairs like oh, this long yeah, now the randomly. piss me off. I, I get hair on the inside of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> hair all the way up but the shaft of my dick and all the way over on the knob. <laughs> Underneath the fourth. Dude, skin. it's everywhere. Yeah, yeah, if I can show hair. you guys my balls, I would because it's nice and smooth. I piss hair. I piss hair. So go to Manscaped <laughs> and it's for women too and that. Mm, anyway, which is yes. important. All right, let's have a f- bong break and we'll be right back with trauma trivia. Or trauma. Actually, yeah, this week oh, we'll, yeah, give, sh- we'll give my special request to this. <gasps> I've got one. No, but do it. It takes some energy. You guys won't like it. Well, who cares? It'll be funny to watch Marty do it with no energy. Okay. It well, probably right. won't be funny at all, but okay. it'll be, be good for me. All right, we'll be back with my special needs. Have a bong. <laughs> yeah. And we're back. We have James here to be the judge Mr. of my Lee. special needs no, request. No. Now, look, I've got two. I could go dark, but I'm not going to. Should we push the button? Don't we have a jingle for this? Yeah, yeah we go jingle. Oh, three, four. My arm's five, a bit sore today. <coughs> six, Just be seven. Seven. It's an improvement. That's good, Matt. He was number nine of worms. <laughs> His body's full of germs. <laughs> he was school captain. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> My is. God, is he happening? <laughs> He can only see While his friends are not pleased With his special His special needs This is Michael's special needs Let James hear the full one. Fuck it. It's a full song. (laughs) This is Michael's Michael's special needs. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Wow. <laughs> I haven't heard that before. <laughs> yeah, it's oh, good. Man. It's good. It was, yeah, it was good. good, I guess. Okay, so now this week we're going to go full on. I really enjoyed, you know, when Marty did Yu-Gi-Oh! I thought that was some of the, <laughs> the best thing I've ever seen in my life. I still watch it now and then. Oh, this no. week we're going to go to something we're all familiar with. We've got Dragon Ball Z. We grew up with it. Okay. Now, oh. it's not going to be a transcript from one of the episodes. It's going to be the best. Kamehameha? Yeah. Oh, I knew it. Yeah. Oh, that's so f- <laughs> So, Fuck, I'm not a good judge of this. I've never watched that show. <laughs> so it's basically like Do a I need power. to look it up, what can it we, looks can like? We, can we hear a Kamehameha so we can just get it in? They're, yeah, they're very long. But uh, yeah. oh, really? Oh, well, it's not that low. It depends how passionate oh, you are. Yeah. Remember, enthusiasm, passion, heart. Dude, they can You'll go be, for a whole episode. You, you, you power up and then when you go to fire it, you've got to look down. Uh, we'll make it, uh, maybe do it at James. Oh. So James can see it and then they'll see on the, the, the uh, wide view, like the passion that you have. So that's a short one, okay? That's a short one, but it's basically calm, eh, calm, eh, calm. Ah. So it's like a power thing that yeah, he shoots slowly out, builds shit. up, slowly builds up. Yeah, like yeah. Right. you get louder as you go. So you the come, eh, come, eh, come, eh, come. A bit repeats to build up. Yeah, Is that calm, what happens? Eh, calm, eh, calm, eh, oh, the ah. harm eh repeats. It start, yeah. So it starts with calm, eh, and then you go harm, eh, harm, eh, harm, eh, ah. Yeah, and then you finish with ah. But Do you yeah. have to remain seated? Um, yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. All right, I'll do this one first, hey? Why do you get to go first? Well, you can go first if you want. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Come Hard work, man. Should we just sit this one out? Yeah. <laughs> you win, Michael. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> anyway, I'll get my turn. Okay, man. Dude, that was very good. It's hard work, I must say. Oh, no, there's no way. Work. I'll tell you right now, there's no way. <laughs> Marty's not in the energy <laughs> stage to do this. This is why we thought it'd be funny. <laughs> All right, look, you know, just do what you can do. It's my special. No, none of us are going to have the passion that you just had. That was yeah, very good. James is the judge. I might win. This, this table. F- <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, Matt, you want to go next? <laughs> sure. <clears throat> do you want me to, do I need to, I'd shoot it at Michael. I still get the idea. Yeah, yeah it's all about the sound. Don't actually, don't well, do a real one though, because I don't want to get hurt. It could the room on. <laughs> You're dressed like a Dragon Ball Z, kind of. <laughs> He's <Yeah>. trunks. <laughs> One that works in an office. <laughs> Red hair trunks. <laughs> <laughs> He's part of it. Ka- oh. <laughs> 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 Fucking hell, buddy. Oh. Wow. Hey. <laughs> ah, what's the rest? Oh. Dude, you have. Hame. Oh. Hame. Oh. Oh, dude. Yeah, I knew. Oh. I knew it. You are shit. Yeah, sorry. I've just Man. got brain damage. It's not. It's not brain damage. It has to be like. It's like. It's uh, a You were born like that. No, you, I like, can't because then I get, I get put off. As soon as Marty laughs, I get was drinking when you were in the womb. Hardcore. Don't you talk about my mother. Like, hardcore. <laughs> Maybe my dad was drinking when I was in the sack. Did You're you ever like, think about that? You have that thing that people have with like the lip thing problem where it's like a problem cleft but, palate yeah but you don't have that it's just that's in your brain you've I got a scar on your you've brain you've got a brain I thought he meant this <laughs> Matt won the race Matt was the fastest sperm <laughs> yeah I know that's hectic man mm. Greg's okay sorry <laughs> oh, Michael's man, still in the lead so just. embarrassing man fuck who would you want to shoot at? Do I remember don't to actually I do want to shoot at the audience. Okay. Hell yeah. <clears throat> God. Your heart's not in this today, is it? <laughs> really not. <clears throat> Kamehameha. Oh, that was nice. It was like a melodic version. Very friendly. Man, yeah. it's, I know I've won. 
Yeah, That's Michael Michael won. Thank you. I think Matt came second and Marty brought in bronze today. But hey, hey, it was a bit, bronze is good still. You still get a medal. I'm on the podium, man. Exactly, Rolla. It's just, yeah, it was the Paralympics. That's Did you sure. like that show when you were a kid? I used to love it. Is it good? I watched a little bit of it. I didn't watch much of it. Very yeah, I watched the first few seasons <coughs> and then I gave up. Did you guys watch Monkey Magic? Yeah, that was in school. We'd have that as a Chinese lesson. We'd learn Chinese through that yeah, show. Chinese lesson? Chinese. Yeah, Mandarin. And they basically, it was, it was I'm weird. asking was what never, you had for lunch. <laughs> 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 I was going to say, they never actually had Mandarin. Well, I didn't understand that. Yeah, I don't get Clever. it. <laughs> you just, you just, <laughs> Mandarin is the language and a Mandarin is also a fruit. Orange, like a normal orange, but a bit smaller and a bit more uh, oval shaped. You peel it, pull out segments, seeds. You lost him. No, all right. <laughs> well, we'll talk about it at lunch. Well, thank you, James, that's for coming. That's all right. I didn't really out. do. It was pretty easy to judge, to be fair. But yeah, look, that's that's my special needs request this week. Thank you, everyone, for being a part of what I like to do. <laughs> Did you get mad at him for the wedding? No, we we just we just spoke about. We didn't really talk about the drunken antics much. Just yeah, hectic. <laughs> You wouldn't remember anyway. <laughs> Apparently Ryan told me that you were saying you want another beer and then I just thought it was the funniest thing ever when we got back here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah that's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fucking power vomited all over the road. Oh, God. Yeah. Anyway. But are we doing fussy Jesus, boys What's now? that? Well, well, well. Yeah, yeah, I mean, we could do... F- oh, actually, Fuck. I need to ma- I mean to make sure it's properly prepared. Right. Trauma, trivia, trauma, trivia, trivia. And this is a segment where we answer questions. You get it wrong, you get hurt. So now, very I'm simple. Sure Brown, you've gotten like a wet tea towel. Today's subject <laughs> is the Olympics. Oh, I actually had it out of the Olympics for a while, but um, we never picked that one, so we're just going for it. Oh, are you ready? Yes. <laughs> Go on. Question number one. When was the first known Olympics Games held? So the first one that the first known one. Greek. The first recorded one in history. When? Held. Yeah, now Marty gave you a good hint there. Greek. So think f- old times. I'll give you a hint. It's uh BC. Oh gosh. Gosh. Three, two, one. one. 200 BC. 2000 BC. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, The answer is... Oh, God. 776 BC. Oh, you get it. So Michael just gets that one. I don't think this is going to hurt that much. I'm not too worried about this. Put some power into it. Go as hard as you want. What's what's whip in German? (laughs) Weiß (laughs) nur einfach nicht mit dem Teilen tut. Prepare for pain. Yeah. Oh, a little bit at the end. I but feel yeah, like no, Marty's oh, going to hurt me. That's yeah. a two out of ten. I bet Marty did some whipping in school with towels. Shit. I'm in trouble here. I'm in a lot of trouble right. here. Question number two. Fine. Which country hosted the first televised Olympic Games? For televised? First televised Olympic Games. So the first ever Olympic Games that was actually put on a TV screen. Which country hosted that Olympic Games? All right, ready? Three, Three, two, two, one. United Kingdom. United States. Oh, wow. You are both wrong. What What is is it? It It was the motherland of Germany. I was going to do that. 1936, Hitler did a big, massive speech about German superiority um, with their technology. And the proof was that they were putting the Olympic Games on the TV. And did they win the most medals? I don't know about that. But if you do watch the film Contact, they do have a bit of that scene in it. So, you know, hidden gem. Oh, ow, ow. I got oh. my knee. <laughs> yeah, I got knee. Ow. <laughs> Dislocate. Oh. I think oh you need God. to go higher on Marty to get a bit of pain out of him. Okay, well, look, it's hard. I just want to make sure I hit. Three, two, one. Oh, oh it nipped. It nipped. That's why you got to swipe. It would have been nice. 
<laughs> Which city was the first to have an opening ceremony for the Olympics? Is it A, London, B, Berlin, C, Paris, or D, Los Angeles? <laughs> Which city was the first city to have an opening ceremony? Three, Three two, one. London. London. Yes! Oh, we're going to hurt Brown. Oh, <laughs> oh, yes! oh, 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 oh. oh it's so <laughs> <laughs> so you have to take all your clothes off. You have to take all your clothes off for this. I will remove the jacket so you can do arm, um, not my right. Get his dick. Get Matt's dick. <laughs> across oh! his face. Get his face. Just give the arm Smash and Smash across his face. Please be nice. Think of all the nice things I've done for you lately. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, shit, my head. <laughs> ah! ah! <laughs> I want to go. Oh, oh yo, no. you don't get two f***ing goes. Yeah, we both get. No, um... you don't. Oh, you you, you chose your you chose oh. your well, we nominate, your man. I nominate Marty to be the hitter. Oh yeah, for next time. Oh wow, look, you're red. <laughs> oh, it whipped around. <laughs> yeah, oh, shit, That's I'm funny. Like that. oh, That's I'm funny. Like, you got I'm hurt. Like, look, gold <clears throat> medals were were made were once made entirely out of gold. So. When you won a gold medal, you got given uh, a What fully... percentage of medals are currently gold? No. What year? <laughs> oh. <laughs> what year did they stop making the medals out of gold? Man, when did they get cheap? I reckon they got cheap. I yeah, don't know your, your brain's starting to f head in the right direction. That's fing good thinking. That's thinking outside the box. Okay, I've got it. I think I know the answer. Oh, hang on. What is the answer? Okay, got it. Three, 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 two, three. one. Nineteen ninety-two. Nineteen seventy-two. <laughs> that was cheap way before that, mate. Oh, it was nineteen twelve. Marty has one. He I gets the to first, hit you. Uh, first Olympics was in Germany. Were televised. Televised first oh. Olympics, nineteen thirty-six. The first known recorded was seven seventy-six BC. Jeez. And then they did every four years. Yeah, oh, apparently. I'm gonna feel That's pain. wild. I don't know about the four-year thing. It's time to feel pain. I'm excited. Yeah, but gold medals stopped in 1912. Shit, man. I thought that would have been around a little bit longer than that. Shit, no, man. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, you didn't get the... I saw it. I could, you could tell. It hit more on the couch. The couch. Oh, man. It's scary. It's disappointing. I'll tell you that much. It's disappointing. Oh. Yeah, it's not a it's, a. it's a weak punishment this week. It's my mistake. No, it would be good if you. It just needs to be done right. <laughs> what year was it? <laughs> no. What no? At the twenty twenty four Olympics, that's this year. Athletes competed in thirty two different sports. How many events were held in total? What. How many events? Like how many in total? So like for swimming, heats. swimming would like 100 meters is one, 200 yeah, yeah. meters is one. Correct. That is a good analogy. <laughs> <laughs> Matt. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, look, I got it. Three, Three two, two, one. 200. 350. Oh my God, Marty. Good guess. No. It's not 350, but it's 329. Wow. <laughs> Oh, I went 350 because that's what a bag costs. <laughs> <laughs> In Paris at the Olympics. <laughs> oh, no. Wow. It's good the bags aren't getting affected by inflation. Oh, no. He's sticking it up. <laughs> <laughs> that was the worst, but it's okay. <sighs> yeah. Oh. Oh, it's red. <gasps> All right, guys, that's trauma trivia. It's pretty Ooh. crazy, man. Man, that was hectic. All right, now it's time for arguably. Oh, no. Look, I before know we say it every on, week. Before you move on, uh, are we gonna we're gonna have to have some pretty hectic punishment for the live show, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking. Did someone do a poo? I reckon no. ru a Russian roulette. There'll be one bullet, <laughs> and then if you lose, you. Go <laughs> <laughs> Uh, or just at the foot. <laughs> yeah. I was, I'll, I'll I was go, thinking, oh, a, I'd go I was thinking some oh. sort of whipping thing, but anyway. <laughs> Look, someone's calling us, eh? Basically, Peter, a, a podcast listener, has sent us a new jingle. He's remixed the Tinder jingle. So we're going to play that. Look, 
today's Tinder is we're calling up a Tinder girl. It's a bit different, but yeah, hey. so not the usual conversations. Like I said, didn't have, ran out of time, but here's the jingle. Thank you, Peter. bit of the end oh, very so, good. so all right james here for fussy little boys now so we'll do the call after but here we go james why don't you explain what we have look the boys have come to watch because they yeah. they've just smelted boiling on the stovetop now i'm excited about this one because i have had the most amounts of requests for this and the only reason i haven't got it is because i've found it really challenging to source but today oh wait hang on where did you source it from was it a, a was a it very reputable source i will have you know off it is. No, it, it's some it is. backyard now, butcher. There is some. There's one thing that's really cool about this this uh, delicacy, which is that it's actually the only food I can think of that is used as an expression to mean like shit. So if you say like something is really shit, like really crap, they use this food to. I reckon use if we that say word. it. I don't think they'll even know what it is because I didn't know. Have what you ever it was heard it? someone say, "Oh, that's tripe." Oh no, but tripe, I can't believe I can smell today, it. Today, it smells what, you Where's it originate? Tripe. tripe. You guys are going to eat well, tripe. Well, I'm glad you asked, Matt, because I'm not going to say the country that it originates from, but I can tell you the animal it originates from. Watch the steam come out of this. Oh. Oh. oh dude. Oh, Pong. So this, <laughs> look at Michael's face. <laughs> this is the it's lining. Good, look at, oh, dude, the smell. The, this is the <laughs> lining of a cow's stomach. So as soon as Ryan smelt it, <laughs> He was gagging straight away because it smells like cow shit. Did you cook it properly? Cow shit goes through this. Every shit this cow did passed through this thing. I want to show you the rest. This food is marinated in shit. Okay, look at that. Oh! Look at it jiggling. Look at it jiggling. Oh! Dude. That is honeycomb tripe. Honeycomb tripe. Why is it honeycomb? Because that's just the look of it. The shape of it. It, doesn't, it definitely doesn't one. taste like honeycomb. Ugh. Not sweet oh at all. Oh my gosh, dude. How, how do we know it's smell? It smells like cow shit. I wish the. the how do we know it's healthy? How do we know it's, uh, we can eat that? This is from Super Butcher. And yeah. he said. He and said, how do I know you cooked it properly? Well, I, did, I Google it. I Google it every time and I find yeah. out <laughs> properly. And so then what you, you do it for extra. is you rinse it in some oh, vinegar, which takes out any impurities, and then you boil it for 10 minutes. I boiled it for 12. So if anything, I've gone over and above. Okay, that makes me feel tougher. That makes me feel a little bit better. What's oozing out the bottom? There's something oozing out the bottom. This is so (laughs) bad. And it's brown. (laughs) I can't look at it. I have to show them up close, man, because that is crazy that all the cow's shit in its life passed through Oh, it looks like the little alien that bursts out of the stomach and alien. It's like marinating in that. It looks like the scalp of some really old with a skin condition. It looks like a pussy from this angle. Look at that. It looks like a f- pussy. Oh, think, dude. Should we, test it on, should we test it on Jet to make sure it's edible? He'll eat f- shit off the ground. Good boy. Yeah, you Good will. Boy. It's just Jet. the worst one yet. Um, I feel so tired I actually, from I it. actually think it is. This is the first one where I've thought, there's no f- chance I'm trying this. Really? Nope. No Why chance. Not? The just smell, the dude. Smell and just it what smells it is. like cow shit. Like and that shit. is because how are you meant, how are you meant to shit? eat it? Like like this. Well, they they eat it in Do Mexico they and they eat it in Asia. And the simplest way to eat it is to boil for ten minutes and then put some put some bloody salt salt on it. Get it down your guts. Mm, yum 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 yum. Salt. I did not. I want you to. I want you to. Exper- I put salt in the water. Oh man, it makes me fucking tired just thinking about it. Oh dude. 
The salt would have made it. Jenny, you want to try some tripe? Oh, look, let's see if the dog you eats it. If the dog the eats it, it's good for you. Hey. Oh, 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 straight wow. down the gut. He's that. fucking smashed yeah. that. Oh, Clicked his lips too. Yeah, do you oh, have a it's feel? not good. Oh, Look dude, at this. It feels quite interesting. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is so much. It's probably good. harder for Michael because he loves oh. cows. Is that inside out? Inside. Inside. Oh, yeah. Are you just meant to gnaw into it? Well, no, you're supposed to cut it up, but I just thought it looked more spectacular have a bite out of like it. this. Just have a bite out of it, Brown. Oh, no, I know what you're going to do with that liquid. Oh, oh. I thought you were going to oh. slop it all over it's Michael's It's hot. Clothes. I don't want to burn. <laughs> you burned me off. <laughs> Could snap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it just you know, it looks like oh, a it looks like, like a that's sponge. touching where you have to bite from. It looks like a sponge. Matt's it's growing like, in confidence. I can feel it. Not really. Oh. It's, I wish it wasn't so hot. He's pretending it's a woman. Oh gosh, this is so rough. Wow, this is gonna be fun to watch. <laughs> sure, Whoa, why surely, are we doing this? surely you've had worse pussy than that. <laughs> no, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh Brown loves going growling chicks out, and this is what he does. Oh yeah. Oh god, you can't chew into it. Yeah, you Do can. You want me to slice gonna, you a bit yeah, off? Can you slice a bit, please? I might take. Oh, it. oh is it really, dude? It's like rubber. Yeah, I thought it. Yeah, would well, be. I did. I overcooked it, but I wanted to be sure. That's all right. I'm and I wanted to make that. it as hard to chew and swallow <laughs> dude, for Michael. As possible. Dude, it's gonna take ten minutes to chew. It's so oh, look, it looks like scales. Yeah. Or something. Oh yeah. What's the inside look like? Uh, oh, the inside, the inside is fucking horrid. Oh, <laughs> oh, look at the inside. Show, show us the, the inside. Show Michael oh. the inside. Oh. Oh. <laughs> show Michael the inside. Show about. everyone oh, yeah. the inside. That is fucking outrageous. Maybe oh. We can... oh, oh, the smell. Look at, can, can they see that from here? I think uh, so. Oh, gosh. Oh. Look at that is... Feces, the feces. Yeah. Stop the it. Fucking it. Stop it. Flip it inside out. Look at this. Where does a hat? Dude, it's even rough touching it. Oh, Ryan said you couldn't pay him any amount of money to eat this. Look at the boys. They're covering their face. It's really not. Right, let's just get it done. <laughs> All right, three, two, one. Oh, yeah, bro. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> I feel a bit raw. I'm going to give Michael this bit. Look. Is it like overcooked calamari, kind of? Yeah. It's not good. <laughs> Chew it into the mic. I want to hear the sounds it makes. <laughs> look, hear at, that? Look, look at the bit I'm giving Michael. <laughs> oh, I'm going to snip that bit off because I don't want you to get that bit. I only want you to get the fuck bit. Oh, dude, this is so fucked up, man. <laughs> Try Really? Oh. I'll have a smell first because I want you to get the cow shit smelly from it. Oh, it tastes Whoa, like it shit. does smell like bog. It does smell like cow shit. Okay, I'm not going to think Jenny. about this. Good. Oh, jeez. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Ever since you said bog, I can't get bog. You're gonna have to put it in. It's too big. Here, Marty, cut him off. A oh no, he got some in. How enough? It smells like cow paddock. Show how much you've got. (laughs) 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 Rubber ball of shit. If you go at me, I fucking hurt you. I will do something bad to your family. Oh, your whole family. <laughs> I will do something bad to your family. Hang on, I'll take this bit off. Oh, I know you oh, can. Look oh, look at the tube. Ooh. Oh, that's where the lip. <laughs> that's where the blood. That's where the blood coagulates. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> I'll try to eat it. I'll try to eat it. Oh, 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 try and fight! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got it. Oh, oh, I can't go with it. Where does it become mask? one with the tripe? Yeah, tripe doesn't bother me that much. Look at this. Look at the tube. Oh, no, look Let's at cut that off. 
Oh, tube. Oh, oh look okay. It's just, oh, oh Mike, you should eat that bit. It's springy. Oh. I was swallowing it. Oh. <laughs> I can't so do this. this rubbery. Is like- <laughs> <laughs> it's like rubber chewing gum, oh. organ gum. You're oh. right. It smells like cow paddock. <laughs> Can I have like a smell? Curious. I just swallowed that. I just swallowed it that. It smells ah! like. Oh, ah! we're so close. Ah! Uh, no. uh, we're oh, very good. Boy. It's in my teeth. Ooh. It's in my teeth. It's in my teeth. You've got cow gizzard in your teeth. Oh, oh shit. Oh, me. Oh, 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 Gonna smell oh, like oh, cow. Oh, Stop tripe. leaning towards me. Lean tripe the other way. Tripe. I'm sorry. Look at my teeth. Oh, yeah, it is. Do you want some dental floss? I don't think even <gasps> dental floss will get that out. You need a f- oh. nail gun to get it out of Yuck, your teeth. It's all over me. <laughs> oh, man. Well, thank you very much to the legend yeah. rings who recommended tripe. Very Dude, good one. Smells like. What do you give it's, it out of 10, boys? You got to rate it. Uh, hey, that that hey, wasn't I the smell word. like cow shit. Smell yeah. your hands. It, sm- oh, it yeah. smells like cow shit, but oh, honestly, yeah. not the worst one oh, I've had. Oh, yeah, Sick okay. dead animal. I'm oh. going to give it a four. On the, wow. on the scale, it's not that bad. Is it the thought that is the worst part? Yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah, Michael's always very thought orientated. Yeah. I described that one quite well. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> cunt. Throwing organs at each other. Got through. <laughs> <laughs> got through and raised him. <laughs> Look oh, no. how much saliva he has. Oh, dude, you're so, so close to throwing chew. up. You chew so yeah. much, it was just so watery. <laughs> he can't get it. Oh, yuck. Looks like you got a whole calamari in between your teeth. I'll, nah, I'll break I'm, something. I'm d- <laughs> I'll rip your basketball cards up. Oh, oh, right. That's too far, that's, Michael. Yeah, it's gone too far, man. Come on. Oh, touch this. What's this feel like? Oh, it's slimy oh, dude, and shit. Dude, that was so horrific. <laughs> That's the it's worst so bit for horrific. me. Yeah, it's in me. That's in me. <laughs> it's the smell that gets me. Oh, my hands stink. The parasites from that? the snail will probably eat it though. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, listen to that. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's move Scratchy on. Scratchy rough. Like I can deal with this day. Oh yeah. When so it's like that, so it can. It must be able to like stretchy. It must be quite stretchy. Try yeah. stretch it. Uh, have a bog. Let's see. Oh man, that was dope. Right. Go Sorry. and have a bong break. We'll be right back with Tinder Adventure Call. <laughs> All right, guys. Like I mentioned, I'm very sorry. No Tinder Adventures this week, but next week there will be bangers galore. Okay. Now, we have the number of one of the Tinder Adventures conversations. You might remember this. We've gone back to it uh, occasionally. It's the one where Luke is demanding that she gives him her house. Okay? <gasps> so she has a house in Melbourne and the conversation was kind of like, house oh, like just give me, give me the house. That's right. House in Thailand. She lives in Melbourne. <laughs> she, she has a house in Thailand and Luke just kind of wants the house. So I'm just going to continue on with that and just – Demand that this woman that I've never met before gives me a, her house. Hey, how are you? I'm good. Oh, it's how been. How are you? Oh, uh, yeah, not too bad. It's been a little while since we spoke. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to call you and just kind of keep our flame alive. Where are you now? I'm still in Brisbane at the moment, but like, if I come to Melbourne this time, can we can we see each other? Yeah. Can I stay at your house? If you want. No. I'll, do, I'll just you sleep can't. on the couch. I'll just sleep on the couch. And like, no, and then. No, no. Okay, and then, like, in the morning, I'll, I'll go straight away. So it no, won't, no, won't be I a big deal. I'm look, literally you, looking you at flights right now. You can't because I stay with my housemate. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Allowed. Yeah, that's okay. Just, just, I don't mind about that. And just say to your housemate, oh, I've got a friend um, just staying on the couch, like, <laughs> I'll, I'll be so like out of the way and stuff. Like you seriously won't even know I'm there. So like, I, are you I free? No. Are you free this week? What's I'm your not work sure, like? But What's your work like this week? I could come to Melbourne this week. Yeah, I, I work someday, but like tomorrow, Thursday, um, 
Yeah, yeah. Thursday yeah. would be better because then, like, um, like the flights are less expensive if they're if they're a little bit further away. Um, and then and then that'll give you time too to kind of prep your roommate and just kind of say like, um, oh, like I've just got a friend like staying over. It's and like I'll literally oh. like if you guys want to watch TV and shit, like I'll I'll leave I, the room, totally like I'll stand outside the house and stuff. And then like when your roommate's gone to bed, then that's when I'll come in and I'll just sleep on the couch. I'll get up like five a.m. Gone. You won't even see me again. Okay. <laughs> Yo, listen to me. Listen to me. Yeah. I said no. It means no. You can't. But but why though? You, you like to... why? I don't get it. No. Yeah, I don't get it's why the though. Point how... Yeah, but can you just tell me I why? Want... Can you just tell me why, and then I'll, I'll, I won't ask again. Because I don't want to get trouble with me. Yeah, yeah, but like okay. I'm saying, like if you just like say to the, the, your roommate, like oh, I've got a friend staying over, like, but like your the roommate won't even like see me and stuff. If you say that to your roommate, like your roommate won't care at all. So that's not a problem anymore. No, yeah, you, have a problem. How come though? Like I just kind of like, – because you had a problem and I kind of solved that problem and you're still saying no, I just don't like get it. Don't you want to see me or something? If you come and book a hotel, it's okay. Yeah, but like what if like I come over and see you and then like I get tired and shit, like I'm going to need to sleep and stuff, you know? It's up to you, but I told you already, you cannot come yeah, here. Yeah, I, I know, but like it's just kind of confusing because – you haven't really told me like why I can't stay over, and that's just like, it's just like yeah, like I don't get it. Like I'm so confused right now. I just want to sleep on your couch. It's not a big deal. Okay, I I have to go now. Okay. So okay, so I'll book for Thursday then. Okay. Okay, I'll book for Thursday, and then you just let your um, roommate have a chat, and um, and then we no, can meet no. up and no, we'll, we'll go for no. coffee. I said no. Yeah, but like, well, what about? Do you still want me to come to Melbourne? Even I, got, I thought I feel like I'm the only one putting in work into this relationship. You kind of like, like I've come to Melbourne. This would be the second time I've come to Melbourne, and like the first time I came, I was like, it's actually like really hurt and shit you, that you didn't even come and see me. Oh, God, sorry. I'm, okay, if, if 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 you book a hotel, I will go to see you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah? okay do you promise? Yeah. Okay, and you promise that you'll at least speak to your roommate, like just at least speak to them and see if I can sleep on the couch. No, I <sighs> said no. Suki, you you you're killing me here, like. <sighs> no, I said no. It's me, no. Okay, well, can I sleep in your room then, on the floor? No, no. Oh, <sighs> I don't need much, just a pillow. Like I've got a big jumper I can lie on. No. Okay, <sighs> please please stop S now. Suki. I have to go now. Okay, well, I'm going to book flights for Thursday, okay? So I'll be there like Thursday, like lunches, I think, and then we can meet up for coffee. How's that sound? Okay. Like, I honestly think that we have something, and I, I feel like I'm falling in love with you, maybe. I don't know if you feel it too, but, yeah, I, I, there's something between us. I don't know. I just feel like I, I'm drawn to you, and I need, we need to explore this. Okay, please book the hotel and tell, let me know where you're going to stay. Okay, well, what, what like, part of area of, like, Melbourne and shit? Like, do you do I go, like, North Melbourne, like, in the middle somewhere or some shit? Like, what part of Melbourne and that? Yeah, Port Melbourne is okay. Port Melbourne or St Kilda or okay. CBD. Okay, yeah. cool. All right, well, I'll, I'll go to St Kilda. Um, But I just need to know, like, like, is this, like, going somewhere for you? Like, how do you feel? Like, do you, do you love me? I never meet you. How? How? I I even don't know anything about you. <sighs> yeah, okay. No, that makes sense. Who are you? Yeah, I'm Luke. My name's Luke. Yeah, I, we never meet, meet before. We have to meet first. Yeah, but like we've been talking for so long. Like surely that counts. Like no. we've sent each other so many messages and shit. Like. No, oh, but you never, never This is so frustrating, you know. It's just like I put so much time and effort into this and like – I just want us to be together. Like, I just really want us to be together. Um, so, yeah, I like, because it's like so hard. Like, I'm getting emotional again. This shit. God, relationships are so difficult. Like, I'm moving to Melbourne. I have to move to Melbourne for this to work, Suki. Okay, let me know. Okay. You Why don't you love me? me? Like, I don't get this. Like, what's what's going on? Are you seeing someone? I, we, we never... Are you f seeing someone? Never. If you're seeing someone, seriously, like, just tell me right now. 
because I will cancel my return flight and I'm staying in Melbourne if you're seeing someone because I'm not giving up on you, Suki. I'm not giving up on this, okay? I don't care how many challenges are in the way. I don't care about your roommate, okay? Your roommate will not come in between us and I will find out who your roommate is and I will speak to them personally, okay? And I will make sure that they're okay with me sleeping on the couch. No. <sighs> yes. Okay, yes. Okay. No, yeah. no, you just move S the Suki, hotel yes. and you go to... Suki, yes, I'm sleeping on your couch, okay? I'm not taking no, no for an no. answer. Yes. Yes. No. Yes, I am. Stop now. No, I no, no start now. We start now, okay? Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Are you crazy? I think you're crazy. Suki, I'm in love, okay? Call me crazy, but I'm f***ing in love with you, okay? I don't know what's going on, but my f***ing... Feelings are running wild with love for you. God, I don't know what it is. Your face is so pretty and shit. Oh, I just want to kiss your lips so badly, Suki. You're my you Suki Buki. Yes, yes, I've spoken to you, Suki, okay? Some people meet online and they fall in love and then they meet. That's happened like hundreds and hundreds of times. God. Your roommate. Your roommate is making this so hard. Uh, stop. And oh, please send a message to me. I have to go now. Okay, I Suki. I have to go now. All right, well, I'll let you okay. know the flight details, okay? I'll see you on Thursday. Okay, bye. Deep, deep shit. I love you, Suki, okay? She's hung up. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude. Whoa. <laughs> that is heavy. That's heavy. <laughs> Deep shit. <laughs> That's the last thing she heard you say. Deep shit. She waited for a bit. Just and oh, then hung up. Dude, okay, wow. Like I think we've oh, got Luke's got a golf. Yeah. Eh? And he's gotta to go to Melbourne on Thursday. <laughs> dude, man. Well, look, we didn't uh, we didn't ask for her house. Yeah, I got sidetracked. But, but <laughs> if I, I if I feel if I was trying to convince her of the couch and then the house on top of that, should have been like, yeah, yeah. we, we got to play it. We'll keep, yeah, yeah, we we'll start gotta, small. Yeah. We'll follow this We're up next week. Slowly making progress. And then I reckon next week we say we came to Melbourne, um, but my phone was dead. I was I couldn't. I, there was nowhere to charge it because you wouldn't Dude. let me at your house. And if she agrees to meet up with me, we should like hire an actor, like someone who doesn't look anything like Luke, like maybe like. Like just some like old guy to meet up with her and pretend to be Luke. <laughs> well, yeah, that's getting heavy. Be hard Sorry. to film that. But look, and we have right, to go to we, Melbourne. We, there's something there. I think there is like the house. I think that the house is on the cards. Luke is now in a relationship. That's official. I'm pretty sure. And he's all, he'll be a homeowner by the end of it. Yeah, that's Holy the goal. Shit. But the look, goal of the Tinder <laughs> Adventures is to get acquire a house. That is, man, that's so the goal. Much. Oh, yeah, so so passionate. Oh, okay. Deep shit. <laughs> I, think, I think that's her name, Suki. Oh, oh, no. If that's not her name, that's going to be just quickly check. quite strange for her. Oh, man. Okay. This Tinder's one. getting like, it's evolving now. We're literally just calling up chicks and demanding shit. Getting Luke into relationships. Yeah. Sorry, Luke. <laughs> He won't be. He'll be happy when he owns a bloody house in bloody Thailand. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, we got a new boys trip holiday destination. Mm. hell. That is heavy duty shit. Deep shit. <laughs> Deep <laughs> shit. She doesn't want me to sleep on the couch. Man, this is this is only one of her. Like she gave out her number so easily, right? Yeah, and she still she must continues have some to talk. Intense conversations, dude. With she's people. literally said like, "You are crazy" to me so many times, <laughs> but still continues to talk to me. Hey, love is crazy. Yeah, love is crazy. <laughs> okay, look, it's time. You got time for us picking up your was your ha 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 ha. ha, ha. It's it prank call time. time. So this dude came to Australia. Um. Back in 2022 and had some issues because when he worked as like a, a farmer, like a, you know, uh, in the fucking fields. Fruit picker. Fruit picker. He uh, never paid any tax on the money that he earned here. So we can call up as the Australian tax office mm. saying that he owes a certain amount of money for working from this time, um, from blah, blah, blah. So. Hello. 
Yeah, g'day. Uh, my name's uh, Raymond Schiffliff, and I'm from the Australian Taxation Office. Um, am I speaking with a... Yes, you are. Okay, mate, great. Um, look, we've um, we've just uh, so basically what I do um, is I go through uh, tax returns and just kind of follow up um, on on uh, on businesses and companies in Australia, um, and we're just going through the um, um, farm business, um, and they've uh, claimed that you um, did some work for them um, in twenty twenty two, and we've just pulled up your um, tax report, and in that year. Um, there was no um, income claimed for the job that they're claiming that you did. So I was just calling to try and get that cleared up. Yeah, yeah. To be honest with you, I mean, to go back and do that. Um, because he, I, from memory, if I'm right, you had to be out, we had to be out of the country 12 months to be able to claim it back. Mm. Yeah, right. Yeah, no. So, yeah, uh, okay. Uh, so so you, you're saying you're admitting that you uh, didn't put that down in your tax return and that you haven't paid tax on that income. Is that right? Uh, I thought we had, but I've then been out of the country 12 months, so I thought we could claim it back. Yeah, no, it's 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 quite clear here. I'm just looking at um at your file. Yeah, no, you, you did not pay any tax in Australia, and they're uh that that they've got you on the books saying that you weren't um a bit of money here working for them. Um, so, you know, that the fact that um, you um, are, now, are admitting that you haven't paid tax on that's actually um, a criminal offence. Yeah. Um, and, and, and uh, yeah, that, that is uh, punishable. Um, we, we could we could press charges here. Um, so I think we should try and maybe um, work something out um, unless to, to avoid a lot of these fines. Yeah, well, if we can work it out, that would be grand. Yeah, look, um, okay, look, so so currently um, it, it just just looking at the numbers, it would roughly be about um, $10,000 tax that you owe, but I can't, um, because you didn't file it, um, there there is all, an automatic um, sort of multiplication that applies to it, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, that applies to it, um, and that's not to mention the fine. So it could be up up towards twenty thousand dollars just simply because you didn't uh, claim it, uh, put it on your tax return. Um, like we can waive the fines if we can kind of fix that um, payment up within the next uh, ten business days. I can waive that, but if I can't, we might have to extradite you back to Australia, um, where you'll have to go through the legal process. Right. Okay. Yeah. So do, is that um, is that twenty thousand dollars? Is that something Australian? Obviously, it would be an Australian. Is that something you think that you would be able to kind of um, transfer through in the next kind of two weeks? Twenty thousand dollars. Yeah, no, I know. Yeah. yeah, it's it is a lot of money. I understand. Yeah. Well, it's yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry, Josh. My hands are kind of tied. Then um, I'll have to I'll have to push this through. To, to the um to the AFP, um and what they what they're going to do is it, they're going to get in contact with um the UK government right and they're going to issue um an expedition notice okay so the police the police may arrive at your door in the next kind of two to four weeks um and and they'll issue you you won't have to pay for your flights um to Australia but they will issue you a, a fly to Australia and you'll have to come and just go through the legal process here. So I suggest you start getting uh, maybe your affairs in order just to make the process a bit easier. Um, yeah, right, okay. So, okay. sorry, it's quarter to five in the morning. Um, oh, I'm so sorry. Little. Yeah, we, we don't, yeah, the, the time uh, difference, of course. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, um... Yeah, right. So, can you tell me exactly how much, if you got it in front of you, how much I exactly earned while I was over there? Um, just looking at it, I, I can see, just off, literally off the top of my head, I can see it'd be about 10000 but just because you didn't declare it, um, it is automatically doubled. Um, so, it, I'm, I'm guessing in the vicinity of around $20,000 Australian. But I'll, I'll have to okay. I'll have to double check with the team. I can't get you an exact number, but I can... Uh, message or email you all of the details um, and and the, the the account to transfer to. Right. Okay. And the okay. So with how it usually works with you guys, with us being like on a 
not working on a visa and tax side of things, does it usually work that you can claim your tax back when you've been out of the country? No. So if, if you work in Australia, it doesn't matter if you're um, a citizen of another country, if you're working for an Australian business, that employee has to pay tax in Australia. That is the law, um, yeah, as it currently stands. Yeah, okay. Um, but um, I was under the impression of that when you could claim it back after leaving the country, um, is that is that a correct? No, no. The, um, whoever's given you that information is, um, yeah, that's that's not correct. I, that's not something I've heard of. No, and um, yeah, it's, it's it's illegal. What you've done is illegal. Right, okay. Um, highly, okay. Ed, highly illegal. To to be quite frank with you, um, yeah, you could be labelled a criminal in Australia. It's you could get a recorded conviction here, um, unless we can somehow, like I said, we can we can speed this up. If you can get your hands on ten to twenty thousand dollars in the next two weeks, kind of transfer it over, then we, I can kind of click a few buttons here and make some things go away. But um, yeah, at the moment. Um, I'm I'm going to need ten to twenty grand. Yeah. Okay. So, so if we can do it within the next two, two weeks, ten, ten business we days. Might yeah, ten business days yeah. typically. So yeah, about two weeks. Have you have just um have you uh, ever had any legal issues before? I just need to uh, make some. Uh, by the way, that we'll be recording this information as well. I just need to let you know that. Um, but yeah, have you had any um legal issues before in Australia? Yes. Okay. What 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 have, what uh, what were the charges? Uh, it was an assault case. Assault case. Okay. Well, that shouldn't um, apply. But look, the judge may look more harshly upon you um, because you know you're you're a criminal. Okay. Um. Okay. I can't. I in honest, I can't remember the exact. Um. Yeah. yeah. Um, how do I put it? Um, Look, if, if you can, like, surely hands. you've got some family there, you can just borrow some money off. I'll just get, send you my bank details and you transfer me the money and I can make this go away. Sure, maybe just uh, when, when it gets a bit earlier, when your family's woken up, maybe give your parents a call, your fa- friends, anyone. I don't care. Just get your hands on some money and send it through to my bank account, please. It's time yeah, right, okay. And who, who exactly am I speaking with? It's time to grow up, Josh. Okay, I told you who you're speaking with. It's, uh, it's, it's time to f- grow up and pay your f- taxes. You're a f- criminal, mate. <laughs> this is my, this is Marty. Oh! You burnt the cans. <laughs> when did you realise? Oh, I've just opened my phone up and your contacts come up. Oh, <laughs> oh damn it. Oh, so you knew the whole time. Uh, well, the problem is, is that you've actually kind of panicked me a little bit here. <laughs> I just got off a slight from... <laughs> yeah. So you did cheat yourself a bit? Oh, yeah, my... um. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's a little good. bit. Okay, no, well, that's I'm good. Not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you I can't still believe you can't answered, answer, man. I'm so, I'm so sorry that it's so early, dude. What a <laughs> what a way to wake up. <laughs> I've, li- I've literally just, I've been just been in Greece as well. I go back, just got off a plane, and then just come home and have another full night's sleep in a week. <laughs> oh, oh no! Double prank. <laughs> oh, oh, you oh. poor. F- but yeah, you're all good, man. Don't worry about it. Don't, don't worry about any f- tax problems. You're all sorted. And and stop uh, assaulting people. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was a one-time thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she had it coming. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to get into that one. <laughs> oh, oh, your your mates have um set you up. Who was it, Michael? Was oh, it? Man. Um, I forget that. Oh, yeah, I, know exa- I know exactly who it was going to be. <laughs> okay, sweet. <laughs> anyway, mate, we'll, we'll let you get back to bed. Sorry about that one, eh? Hey? <laughs> no, you're, you're all good. Nah, it's funny as fuck. No, but good on you. <laughs> all right, have a good day. Oh, See you, dude. Farewell, Josh. <laughs> yeah, cheers, boys. Have a good one. <laughs> He's probably like, oh, I've seen him, man. 
shaking right now because he thinks had to come up with 20 oh, grand. I think, yeah, with WhatsApp, we've got to figure out a way to like not have it come up as fully actual podcast. I think we had him for a while, though. He yeah, must, yeah, he no, must have been so out of it. He checked it at the end, he said. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so oh, we had him the okay, whole way yeah. till the end. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, that's hot. Yeah, look. Oh, my. <laughs> that was a roller coaster. I, I was waiting for you to get angry, like, you know, to like sort of merge into, oh, you have to yeah, give me the being, money. Because he was being. He was being sort so like he was being so cooperative. Yeah, wow, that's not a cool. Isn't it get. scary how easily you can you can start getting people to start to, like, yeah, talk about just giving you money? Send, send him bank details, I mean like ATO bank account, and then mm. and then the bank details, and then he would have sent that over. I, I go off to the races. And you got <laughs> oh, money. Man, we could have made some cash. <sighs> uh, oh, oh guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and give us a five star review, please. Just take the time right now and do that, please. Just like, we'll comment, subscribe. Five star review. Don't forget, and we have tickets to the live yes. show 2024. Come and see us, please. Come we be. want to see you guys. You, we, you listen to us all the time. Let's hang out and have a drink together, have a hug, get some crippling anxiety for have a few a days. Water. No! Oh, fuck, Oh, it's all over the so podcast fun. Fun. He's just wet the podcast fun. It's so much fun. He's just wet the podcast fun. We'll see everyone there. It's going to be the best time. We're the oh, best. We'll get that. We're the best. We're the best. <laughs> We're the best. We're the best. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry.